Hello. In this video, I'll show you how to connect perplexity to N8N for AI-powered queries in your workflows. Start by adding an HTTP request node. Click the plus icon in N8N. Search for HTTP request and select it. Next, go to perplexity.ai and log into your account. Navigate to Settings, then API and Billing. Add funds. $5 is enough for testing. In the API keys section, create a new key. Copy your key and save it for later. Now visit docs.perplexity.ai and go to the API Reference tab. Copy the curl command for the API call, ensuring it's in curl format. Back in N8N, click Import Curl in the HTTP Request node and paste the curl command. Importing will override any existing node settings, automatically configuring the URL method and body. Check the Body tab to confirm the setup. You'll need to add authentication. Replace the placeholder token in the authorization header with your Perplexity API key. Return to Perplexity. Copy your API key and paste it into the node's header field. Before testing, edit the query in the body. For example, set the message to, who won the last World Cup? Now. Test the node. The output includes citations confirming Argentina won the last FIFA World Cup. That's how you connect perplexity to N8N using an HTTP request node. For a bonus step, only applicable if you're running N8N locally, install the perplexity community node. In N8N, click your profile initials in the bottom left corner. Go to settings and scroll to community nodes. Click install and paste the package name Check I understand the risks of installing unverified code from a public source. This node is community vetted, so it's safe. Click Install to add it. Back in N8N, search for Perplexity. The node will appear with a community badge. Select it and choose Create a Chat Completion. Configure the node, set your Perplexity API key as the credential, then add a message in the Messages field, like who won the last World Cup. Test the node. The output confirms Argentina won, matching the HTTP request result. That's how you integrate Perplexity into N8N with both methods. I'll see you in the next tutorial.